<laughs> Yo, and before we even go, Ray gave me some a breakdown on that. Yeah, we had Otis, we had two, a girl and a guy that called. And now we're going to have Minister, Pastor, and uh, Third Bishop, <laughs> Chino Life, give us a breakdown of what he thinks the difference is. Ah, I don't have... Yeah. <laughs> I don't have the piano. De los días más. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Chino, talk to me, man. What's the difference? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. before, before that. Welcome to FNF Live. Yeah, Chino, so, so, how, how you doing tonight, I'm man? Doing great. When was the last time you was here, bro? I don't even know. When was the last time? It's I been think, years. Bro? Nah, it's not been years. years. Not that long. Listen, I still want to know about the question. I'll get all to back. Right My to question. Me. The question. I love it, right? You helped me out. The thirst. Whether it be, I'm gonna use a man. Just to just to like not have to go back and forth and say man and woman. Okay. Sometimes you can't define either one of them, cause the 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 church dudes are just as thirsty as the church as as the street dudes. The same thing goes for the females. They, thirsty. The thirst is real, my ladies and my gentlemen out there in Radio Land. Thirst. Um. So you you can't really tell the difference, but this is what I this is what I think is the difference. Okay. Like. Uh, if you want to play a piano, you can play it right now because I'm about to get rid of it. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have piano. It's going to be a spiritual game. And me. make sure you send your tithes and offer to chinolife at gmail.com. Okay. That is the paper. Um, this is what I think. <laughs> as, a, as a woman or a man, I'm, I'm going to use just whichever one it is. When you're in a relationship with somebody, if they are a person that doesn't believe in Jesus, you don't want to have the doctor tell you that your son has a problem or that your daughter has a problem or that your mom has a problem and for your husband or wife that's a non-believer for them to crumble and not have the fortitude to say well baby let's pray a man of God or a woman of God will be like hey bro it done got serious we're not gonna cry about it tighten up let's get on our knees and pray and you need that especially today bro there's drama people getting fired all type of stuff if you don't have nobody that's gonna really hold you up when those times come everything else is cool sex is like if you go three minutes you good like you're doing good if you go 15 minutes at a home bob bottle so sex gets old because you can't really do it all the day but when you have a person that's you know that, that has that fortitude that backbone that can stand in the pain with you dude that's what separates them all the other stuff yeah whatever i know some really good people that are really good people that don't know jesus and they're amazing people like they have good attitudes they have a great outlook on life businessmen they're awesome and same thing with christians they they can you can find a, a dude that's a worldly guy i hate that title a worldly guy that's just as good as a christian dude but the, what's gonna define it is when times get tough. That's when you'll see what kind of fiber oh, of a man you have. Heck yeah. Ray, what do you think? Um, did you he answer the question? He actually did. It was a long preaching. Chinolife at gmail.com. He wants an offering play, by the way. Put it in a bucket. Listen, either has, or. This guy carries a square app for the offering. I got it right here. Why don't you check it? <laughs> Just swipe your card. Swipe your card. Oh, yeah. So, yo, we're talking about Lunar. It's about how many days away. Because every day Four. I see on your Instagram, you drop some kind of graphic. Four. Four. Cuatro días. Cuatro. Are you what, excited? What, what, what is Lunar? I mean, I keep hearing this Lunar. Yeah, what's Lunar, lunar all about? What, what's Lunar? I it's know what it's about. Cardi that we're, no. No. Um, <laughs> it's, a new, it's a new line of Christian. Anyway. um, Dude, I, I was... um. After after home, I was trying to plot what am I gonna do with the album, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And then the album started coming together, and I was like, what can I talk about? What how can I say my, my life without saying my life or, or how I'm reflecting Christ? And lunar, when you think about lunar, it's the moon. The moon reflects the sun. As Christians, we reflect the sun. S O N. And um and so the the whole album is is it's coming from that standpoint. How do you reflect Christ in your job? How do you reflect Christ in your business? How do you reflect Christ in the radio station? How do you reflect Christ with your kids or with your with your wife? Like how is it that they see Christ in you from just clocking in on time when you're supposed to clock in, clocking out when you're supposed to clock in, um, when things get rough with your wife, not giving up, um, with your kids spending time with them, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. It's just it's a wide range that I can sit here for an hour and explain to you what it means. But it's just reflecting the sun. It's just how do you show people. How do they see the sun on you without you talking? It was no point. Straight universe out here. This is what we, what's going down right now, right? Oh, yeah. So, Lunar. It's a funny thing. I'm actually doing a, a Spanish version of Lunar, and I, I don't know what to call it because I can't call it Lunar. People are going to be like, No entiendo. Oh, yeah, mira. I know. Lunar. Lunar. Cuatro días, four days. Somebody will give it a spiritual significance. Four days, and I got to hear this actual album. Totally different from the first one. You know what I mean? You can't stop to the keys on top. No, none of that. 
it's just a whole nother growth process from what I heard from this album uh, and the first one he did. Of course, it always happens. Yeah. Sometimes it does. You hear the same thing you heard last time, but it sounds totally different. Let's talk about this record, man. Uh, Stop me. I want to play this. Uh, I'm excited about it because there was some records on here that were really banging really hard. Tell me about this song. Let's go right into it, bro. All right, Stop Me is just a record. Um, Me and Don Cherie, Nelson Del Valle, which is one of the dudes that helps me with so many of the hooks and stuff, a brainsy writer. But um, Don Cherie Wilkerson, Pastor Rich Jr.'s wife, we actually got together and did this record. It's basically just talking about, you know, with God on our side, there's nothing that can stop us. I like this. Point this black. is pretty serious. Check it out, yo. It's happening live. I got a suggestion for his album in Spanish. What you got? Lunatico. I need it. Rendezvous Live. 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 Rendezvous I said the name right, right? Don Cherie. That's Don right. Cherie. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Man, I got that right. For my soul, Don Cherie. ¿Cómo se dice eso en español, loco? For my soul, Don Cherie. No. How do you say it in... in Ray, ¿cómo se dice en español eso, loco? Don Cherie. Don Cherie. Don. Ray is the only crazy Dominican that would try something. You might curse. You can't. Don, no. Don Cereza. <laughs> Don Cereza. Cherry. Don't say cherry. Cherry. Cereza is cherry in Spanish. Oh my God. Fresa. You always. No, know. fresa strawberry. No. I said cereza. You said fresa. This is bad. You guys cereza. are going in a whole nother. Bro, you, you don't even know Spanish. Listen, no, bro. And I don't know English either. That's what I think about. Me empato con los dos y me empato. Listen. Hey, uh, Luis Lunar. Come out in four days. Yeah. Uh, yes. Bless God. Yo, what's going on, man? What's so different, man? I, I hear the Spanish accent. I'm like, what's going on? Yeah. 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 I'll tell you this, I'll tell people first of all what I experienced with it. Yeah. And actually, I got emotional about one song because it was real deep to me. I had to see a video, probably the best video I've ever seen you Ooh, do, actually. Yeah. Uh, That's I saw, actually the first video. Yeah, <laughs> well, I saw another. Cobain, yeah, uh, Cobain. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. correct. He looked it good too. Cobain was official. Yeah, yeah. But this one is on La Playa. Yo te digo ahorita. Tu ves video. ¿Cuándo sale eso? ¿Cuándo sale eso? It's dropping Tuesday. It's, comes out, it's gonna be on Rap Zill, I guess. Uh, we're gonna put it up on Good City Music. And yeah, Rapzilla, FNF Live. Oh, mira, el tipo representa. Always. Oh, yeah, so, Luna's coming. What, what's different this year, man, this time around? I mean, I know, I remember, and this is because me and Chino are good friends. I remember when Home came out, the week before he was mixing, mastering, era un revolú, un corre, corre, rey king, ra, ra. I remember all that. What's different this time, man? I know you remember the album release party over there, and we were like, Ray was sending us tracks as we were going. Yeah, I remember that. Wow. wow. Um, a lot of change. But it's, Luna was in, I mean, Home was in 2009, so I've had four years to like sit down and, and, and relax and wait on it and, you know, and just chill. The, the songs have been written for about about a year now. Wow. So it, it was more of the process of my life. I'm in a place right now where it was just, especially even up to now, I'm in a place right now where it's just, our, our time is so limited. So I was able to record the songs and do everything and then give it to Ray King and just like, Ray, just take your time with it. So with this, we had a little bit more help. With Home, obviously I was on my own and I was doing my own. Thank God now I have, you know, um, good cities there. So I'm at, Butter P has been instrumental, Kanata, um, Juan, Tisha, Javon, you know, Martin, Fern, everybody. Needless to say, freaking Ray, who has been amazing, going back and forth with the records and we are listening sessions, change this, let's do this, and no questions asked, has been an amazing engineer. But this one has been easier because of the team and the time. I'm not rushed. I was a rookie on the last one. I was like, I want to put out an album. I need to put out an album. You're anxious. You just want to put something so people can hear it. And this one, I got to chill a little bit and like enjoy it, marry it. I don't like that verse scrap it. Let's do another one. And really put my heart into it. It's a reflection of who I am. So this one is a lot of growth process. Yeah, man. So much has happened. Another child, we got a bigger family. Oh, yeah. Three sons. Bless God. This is a whole heat. You almost got a basketball team. I'm going to kill myself. Die Hard Miami Heat fan. And uh, if you don't know, we be going in on hey, we, hey, 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 we in that summer league. We in the um, quarterfinals. Yeah, I heard. I heard. Shout out to Paul Martinez, who played with Chicago. It. Yeah. How we spanked Chicago and knocked them out of the, <laughs> freaking, um, um, the tournament. Summer league. It might not mean nothing, but we beat them. We beat them. That's all that matters. Oh, yeah. So, the winner's coming out. Who, who's production and who's featured on this Lunar album? Well, we mainly G-Rock and Smash Productions. Smash Productions is a young cat here from Miami. Amazing dude. Make sure you check him out. Um, Smash Dave on Instagram, Smash Productions on, on, on Twitter. 
amazing dude. G-Rock. G-Rock did 95% of home last year. You know, we have an amazing relationship. I can go back and forth with him. He understands what fits me, which is going to be crazy because I'll, I'll talk about some of this other stuff later. But, um, yeah, bro, so I'm excited. G-Rock, absolutely animal. And then, obviously, um, Ray really put his stank on the whole thing. Stank. Like, yeah, yeah. He, he twerked the beats and, and cut them off, chopped them off, and did amazing things. He had actually produced three other records that are going to be that are going to be later on. We're going to give them out as bonus tracks. We're fun tracks with Leslie Grace. Shout out to Leslie Grace. Wow, brother. Wow. Yeah, yeah, I, do do I, say, well, no, I, I don't know why you always do that, because that's, that's the right. only merengue thing I know how to do. There's so much more to that. I can't merengue. do you're anything. It's because you're Cuban. Listen, point is, you're right, right? That's because it's Cuban. Uh, I've never even heard of merengue from Leslie Grace. Yeah, I heard no, Yeah, <laughs> you're right. But anyway, <laughs> but that's his merengue. So that's what I meant. Oh, like lunar. I meant, I meant, I meant, I meant, I <laughs> Mira, como quiera. It doesn't matter, man. Luna's coming out. You talked to me on pro production. Who are the artists that are reaching? Oh, so oh my God. You know what? I'm so excited because when we came into it, I remember sitting down with the team and we were just like, okay, let's start getting these people together to put on it. Oh, I, you know, ideas, people that were out there. If you're listening, we love you. It, it, nothing to do with you, but we. You know, we had Jay in mind, we spoke to her, V Rose, um, Chris Lee, Cobbins, um, so many different people that we had that we had for certain songs. And bro, I, one day I just sat back, man, and I was like, I was at church and I was listening to 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 the worship team. And I was just like, man, at, at, in Trinity Church we have so much talent. So bro, I just sat there and I scrapped everybody that was supposed to be on there and I actually put people from my church. Like uh, all of my hooks are have are people from my church. Actual members, you probably never heard a word from them. You will hear about them, but um, but they're amazing singers, amazing talented people, and then the team obviously, um, you know. Shout Ramos, out to Philip Bixby. Bill, Philip Bixby. He hit me Love up with he hit me up with a text. You know what I mean? He got a new yeah. single coming out. Love we'll see if we get him up in junk is ridiculous. I want to hear it. I want to y'all check it out on iTunes. Um, obviously the team is on there. Raymond's on there. Anthony Rose, Ray King, Social Club. Um, Jael, my God, that woman is amazing. If you have not heard of her, you will hear about her. Um, just so many different people, but everybody's local. Everybody's, and I'm, 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 I'm happy to say it's in house. Like, Look, I'm, I'm talking about. Let's let's go into this because this track is pretty serious. It's called Social Club Mix Misfit Gang Wolfpack. It's like a horrible like word. Feature in Social Club, man. Talk to me about this song. It sounded like I was really fun and simple to do for you guys. Talk yeah. to me about this track. And we just wrote it. We were like, all right, let's do something together for my album. We're trying to have a whole team on the album, on um, cross branding, etc., etc. And then I put something on it that is their brand, Social Club Misfit Gang Wolfpack. It's our brand. It's good city music, but it's definitely their brand. What they they put it out there. So we just wanted to do something that's fun. Something that's um that represents Miami real good or something that we can do live with all our shows most of our shows we do together so social club let's go let's go Have for that live social club Mitchell gang of war we're back finally if I actually even knew what that all meant social club Mitchell gang we're back renegade renegade escribir todo eso loco ¿Cómo se dice en español? Loco? Eso siempre es la pregunta. La Clubo misma. social. ¿Clubo? Sí. Ajá, ah, yo sí. sabía. Puede ser. Clubo. Clubo. No, that's what they say. That's what they say. Ray, how do you club say club in Spanish? Discoteca. No, what is this guy talking about? How do you say club? How do you say club? That's club. club social. Club. Club social. Club. You serious? Yeah. Club. club. Oh, I thought I had another name. No, club. club. I guarantee club. you they have another name, but we're Spanish. We're no, it. club. I'm serious, bro. You know, no, No, okay, <laughs> club. Oh, yeah. Vamos a seguir comiendo. Oh, yeah. Lunar comes out in four days. How do people... Oh, I know you can pre-order. Because yes. it's all over your Twitter, your Instagram. Oh, yeah. It's not even cheating. It's like, go oh, pre-order. Yeah. Forget Gino like that, Gino like that. No, no, no. Pre order. No, that's my name. My kids are my ministry. Pre order, Lord. Open it up and get it. And get it. <laughs> and I think, and you know what's funny? Just touching on that, bro. I, I, it feels so good that I'm in a place where I'm like, you know, I'm on staff at the church. Um, my wife is on staff at the church. She just graduated with a uh, pastoral degree, biblical studies, theology, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, but I'm at a place right now where it's like music is fun to me now, as opposed to home. I was trying to eat from that junk, like was two years of my wife and me doing that, period. Like I was traveling and it was like calling every pastor and like, hey pastor, can you see this video? And it was like the good video for the pastors and then for the promoters, it was like the hood video. Whoa. But um, yeah, bro, and now I'm like at a place where it's like, there's there's no, there's no, I'm not so like in, like I love Lunar and I want it to go out there and I want people to hear about it. 
but at the same time, I'm not dying. If it doesn't work, it doesn't, like, I'm not, like, oh my You're God. You're not pressured like that. Oh, no, there's no pressure. That's the word I was looking You're smart. No I'm pressure. not smart. There's I'm no Puerto Rican, bro. Listen, uh, no either or it doesn't matter. Yeah. Get <laughs> man, look. Oh, yeah. I hey, always shout out to my homie, Ariel Garcia Campo. That's my only thing I can do. Stop hanging on me. We're gonna stop talking about the merengue. Point is, you know how to say "siwa" in your Spanish? I mean, in English. I was about to say in English for real though. You know how to say "siwa"? Don't curse. This is a family show. Sibawen. Sibawen? I'm dead serious. That it's is a real word. You can, you can Google it. I don't know, Ray. You're coming to some real Dominican stuff that's not working. All, all day. Oh, yeah, listen. Like straight straight platinum, 100%. Ray reps his country. No straight plat, baby. Straight plat. Straight plat. <laughs> listen, <laughs> don't play. <laughs> listen, man. Either <laughs> or, uh, I always <laughs> like to ask people about, you know, the state of holy hip hop. Because oh, yeah. it's good to ask ministers this, man. Especially the dudes that just don't do music, but they're in ministry. Uh, and, and you know, since we got, you know, I've asked every other minister that's come up in here. Chino, what do you think about the state of holy hip hop? Where is it? You know, are you mad about it, bitter? Because usually I talk to people, they be a little heated about yeah. the whole situation. How do you feel about holy hip hop? But I think holy hip hop is in a beautiful place right now. Okay. Um, I think that there are members in holy hip hop that are probably not as um, happy with the genre, and that reflects in the music, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. You're like um, bitter. So. Yeah, 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 I think it's in a good place. I think, I think, I don't think it has ever had the notoriety or the view that it has right now, the platform that it has right now, where you can ask somebody on the streets and they'll actually know somebody, and that from that it links into other things. Um, mass media, multimedia is carrying it. They're actually playing it from Lecrae all the way down. Like there's dudes that are doing it. T Bone has been doing it for years. Wow. Um, et cetera, et cetera. Grits. Oh my God, they were everywhere. Petty was everywhere. He even had them Sons of Anarchy. One of his songs was on there. So it's it's at a good place right now. Um, inside of it, there's issues. I think um, as I listen to it now and albums that I download, and I'm people might not know this, but I'm a fan. Like I listen to everybody. They might think that we just no. I'm one of those guys that I literally my wife gets mad at me, but I pay my ten dollars to download albums. Oh, I get a bootleg from Jay Blaze. Oh, that's what I'm doing. Christian, <laughs> Christian bootlegs. Christian com. No, but I pay my ten dollars and I and I go in and I listen to albums. Like that's my I, like I, I want to eat from that because I'm encouraged by a lot of these dudes. I think Christian hip hop now is in a place. Where it's Does it place. disappoint you when you yeah. spend ten dollars and get sometimes? Because it's, this is why, I'm gonna tell you why. Not because of the, the content. The content is sometimes dope, sometimes it's whack. I can listen to anything and, and, I'm, and I'll be pleased and I'll find the gems out of it. What, what I'm not, it's, everything is so dark. Everything is so like, mm -hmm. oh, it's so transparent. It's so like, oh my God, like, you know, this is my life and I'm screwed up and I'm such a sinner and you know, but God, and, and it's like, it's so, it's, it's so transparent that it's good, but it's so dark and so like, if I'm not a Christian, like, we have, we have probably 1,500, 2,000 revolving, 3,000 revolving young adults that come to our church. Wow. There's so many people that I want to show music and I'm just like, even in our, in our rendezvous service, like I have my playlist is like one song out of each album, like, because there's not so, there's so much like, it's so dark. There's no hope in it. There's no like fun stuff that you can play anymore. As opposed to 2008, 2009, it was fun. It was like on um, party, South Beach, everything. If it's outside of Rayma Social, Ray, like most of that stuff is kind of like, Hey, yo, son, like, I want to murder myself because I, you know, I watched porn last night and I'm such a sinner and I'm messed up. And it's like, okay, bro, I understand it. I get it. But at the same time, you want to show people hope, man. When people listen to it, they want to seem like, man, I, I can live like this. I don't want to live. You don't want to like, use the word uplifting, right? Uh, it's not uplifting. Okay. It's not. It's, it's too transparent, I think, right now. So okay. many people are, they're using that junk and it's like... I, and, I, and as opposed to home was like, home was very fun, very punchline-y, very like, ah, I had fun with it. Um, Lunar is very transparent, but it shows hope. It's like, bro, this is where I'm at. I'm in a fun place right now. Like, I, And it's not all fun and games, but it's like, bro, show the hope in the, the light side. In other words, showing a, a light of victory yeah. in our walk with Christ oh, than just a lot of the negative parts of it. I've been here listening to Holy Hip Hop a long time, yeah. and you're 100% right. Yeah. From the fact that all the tracks were sampled in the tour. But point is. And all the beats are stolen from Second Yeah, yeah soundclick.com. But either or, it doesn't matter. It's really come a long way. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I sort of. I'm excited. In Lunar Four Days. How can people get it? Oh my God. Website, all that good stuff. Okay. So let me go pre order that joint right now. Get yeah. 15 copies for your whole youth group. Do it. Um, Definitely you can go on iTunes, pre-order it on iTunes, search Lunar, L-U-N-A-R, um, Chino Life, C-H-E-N-O-L-Y-F-E. You can go on ChinoLife.com, okay. don't go on ChinoLife.com. You can go to 
Twitter and search Chino Life. You can at Chino Instagram. Life. Yeah. You can go to ChinoLife.com and, and find all the things. We're updating it. We're in the Chino Life is C-H-E-N-O-L-Y-F-E. -E. Christ hearted evangelist now offering life. There you go. But life is so L-Y-F-E. Corny. Dude. The getaway. Not the, the ghetto. It's okay. the nice. Yeah, so. They can go on there, chinolife.com. You can look for it on iTunes, everywhere else. Um, it'll be on all the stores, major rate, retail, online, etc., etc. Oh, yeah. Love you, man. Uh, I'm excited to see Lunar. Video, new video comes out Tuesday. Wow. It's not merengue, loco. Yeah, it's coming out on Tuesday, man. The whole album, the shebang, is coming out on Tuesday. Make sure. What's the name of the video? What's the name of the video? Uh, the video is named Real, featuring Jael. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's a secret. Pretty I already saw it, but it's going to be yeah. sick. You're going to love it. Grab the singles, stop me, and um, please don't go this for gang. On FNFLive.com. Bye. Bye. You bootleg my album, you're going to hell. Bye. We're going to this record. FNF Live at 8.3 will be right back. Gapples, I'm higher.